Okay. Uh, maybe you maybe you saw the uh, the flight today. It uh, today it's like uh, February sixteenth. I didn't make it. <laughs> okay. I landed out right about somewhere around here. Kind of stuff. I want to see if I can try this the same flight. This is in Condor, and the uh, Condor uh, multiplayer races they have all the time is called Chin Chin. Uh, let me see if I can. I'm gonna do it here, and uh, I'm gonna do it in Microsoft. Okay, so. I need to, uh, I need to, uh, reproduce it in a, uh, flight track or flight plan that Microsoft understands, which is, uh, which can be created here in this B21 task planner. Okay. I'll put the, uh, I'll put the, um, link here in the description and maybe I'll link to a, a better uh, video on how to, to use this one but I'm just gonna try and edge it okay so we started out here in this I don't know how you pronounce it the Chalox it's a European uh, country so that's the starting airport okay so if you go to, if you go here and you zoom in, you try to to like uh, put these these names here in the search thing here, and uh, either one, and maybe it'll come up with the uh, the right airport. Hopefully, it's, usually it's an airport <laughs> next to it. But okay, so. Uh, this one is it right here. So I'm gonna hit click on that. And there it is. And basically all you have to do is just, just click on it. And it comes up and it puts over here. Okay, so that's the takeoff airport. So have the airport uh, selected. Oops, delete that. It's making a mistake. <laughs> Can just delete it right there. I wanted to like uh, click on this right here, make it go away because I want to zoom in here. I'm just using my scroll reel to zoom in. So that's the starting airport. Okay. All right, so and then like uh, we'll start, we'll start the airport, and then on on uh, Condor they, it does a little bit differently. So you can put the start right there, but you can have people take off of that airport. But uh, Microsoft one, you have to like uh, pick the airport, and then put your start point where it is. So um, a little bit like uh, south of the airport. So we're going to, oops, <laughs> once again. Okay, so I'll put a little bit south of the airport. Right there. And then we're going to call it the start. And then we're going to make the radius a little bit smaller. Thousand. Okay, and right now it's kind of facing the wrong way. As you can see here, it's, this one's facing, starts going, and you going this way. Okay, so if I click over here, it won't make a uh, won't make another waypoint. Okay, so. Let's go back to this. So, 
So it starts there and then it goes this this way. But I don't think there's an airport to where it is. This goes right to here. Okay, so what I need to do is like uh, go on the Condor Club here. And this is my flight track. This is the uh, race I did uh, earlier today, and I didn't make it. Okay, this is the finish point, and this is the start right here. It was it was tough. I'm gonna upload the uh, the video. You can see how tough it is for me. Everybody else. Got there, I got to the first turn point, and then I had to land out here because, like, it was basically a thermal task. And I was doing a flat uh, screen, and uh, not very good with flat screen. So, so you can see my see my plane right there. And I'll scroll there, and you can see how I was going, going, and going. It took me a long time to even get to the start. I don't even think I got to. The start height, 16, which was like uh, 16 millimeters, 1600 millimeters, meters in the air. And uh, 1600 meters in the air. And <clears throat> so I never got to the height. But I did start. And I went here and I had a, dig of a, a hell of a time trying to get high enough to be able to make it to the first turn point. And then I went there, 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 and then like I got to the first turn point, barely. And then like I just had to land out at the airport right here. There was an airport, you'll see it. If you watch the video, you'll see it. All right, so what I want this page for is to try to get the, uh, the distance. So it starts right here, and then it goes for, at a heading at, uh, at uh hitting at 28 degrees for 200 for 54.7 kilometers okay so let me go back to here and i'm going to just hit a point right there i'm going to take this waypoint I'm going to go, and you can see the kilometers right there, and you can see the degrees, and I'm going to go to 54.7, as close as I can, and we'll see how close we get. So, we're going to go to degrees right there, 27 is close enough. I'm going to go... Fifty-seven, fifty-four point seven. Okay. Oops. Come back. Okay. Oop. Okay, and I'm gonna go to twenty. Eight degrees. Okay, we've got to go a little further. Okay. That should be close enough, okay. It's not going to be exact. You know.
All right. And yeah, let's see. I'm going to go back and click it again. And I want to put a circle. I think you just put like a 2,000 meter radius circle. Okay, and I'll put one there. So all your start has like half circle and all your like uh, turn points, you put it in, it'll put a, a, a full circle. Okay, but unlike it and uh, Condor, you can't have, your, it won't highlight in, in, uh, it won't highlight, you know, you just have to like, uh, you won't see a highlight in the uh, virtual world. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, so, but, you know, and like you'll come here and like you'll, you know, you can, you know, it'll click for you once you've crossed that threshold line. Okay. Okay. So let's like go take a look. Yeah. So it kind of looks like it kind of looks like they have it right about here on top of that uh on top of that thing there so we want to grab it pull it back okay and that kind of that's kind of like uh it's going to uh shorten our distance but You can go here and pull this back. There, okay. So there's. Okay, so there's where it kind of, it'll pretty much, well, will match, it'll match it pretty, pretty well. Pretty close. Close enough for government work. Okay, so. Now. I'm going to go to the next turn point. And which is all the way over to here. Okay. Zoom in a little bit and it's on top of a hill too. Okay, and we'll go over here and it is the second turn point not turned just because i didn't make it there okay so uh it's 75.8 and it's at uh 128 degree or 121 degrees not towards the east okay so uh memorize that uh 70 and 75.8 kilometers and 120, 121 degrees. Okay. Go back to the planner. Zoom out a little bit. Okay, again, it's not at an airport. Okay. 
too. You can see some of these names here. Let's like see if we can kind of zoom in here. So you can find something that's like close to it. Let's try street view here. Let's see, is that, was that one of the names? I think so. I think that's right there. Okay. As far as you go in. All right, so I think that's like a name right there. Okay. Let's see. How do they spell it? So tough to see sometimes. Let's see. They call it the uh, hers and hers or something, something. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. It looks like the street there. Okay. There's a lake there. There's a lake nearby. There's a lake. Okay, so we know it is. We know the degree is 121. We know it's like uh, 75.8 kilometers. So let's click here. Okay, so it should, if I click here, it should put it after that one, okay. So is it doing it right? No, nope. delete that. Okay, there we go. Yeah, okay, it's almost there. <laughs> like 27. So let's get the degrees right. It's 121. 
Let's go to 75. Oops. Okay, 75. Okay. Showing that up a little bit. All right, let's see. Go back to the top of the satellite view. I think that's going to be good. See, there's that one right there, and I'm pretty sure that's right there. And it is on a hill. It is on the mountain there. These these maps aren't exactly the same. <laughs> well, you know, little discrepancies, but like uh, I can't push it there because okay, this is you know this is the seventy eight, right? Yeah, one twenty one twenty one for 75 uh 75.8 kilometers so well it's got to be pretty close to it and it looks you know like i said i'm not gonna get it exact it looks like it's on there it looks like it's a hill okay so All right, so that's like uh, that's the airport right there. That's the finish, and it is two sixteen degrees for thirty seven point six kilometers. Okay, let's see if we can find that airport. On the map. Right. 
Mm. I don't really see that name there. Oops. Okay. Okay. There's that. Yep. There it is. Okay. Since it's two sixteen. And this one says like uh for thirty seven kilometers is there Don't think there's any other airport. That's the name of it. I can't pronounce, but I know the letters are the same. Okay, so let's go to like one sixteen. Okay, and. Uh, what is it? 37.6 Okay Let's go back to this thing and it's like zoom in. Way zoom in. Alright. Hmm. I hear it's like close to the airport. But even if I move the other even if I move the other point here. See if I, uh, let's just put a radius right there. See if I move that. Okay, let's put a finish. Give me a warning, tell me I can't do that. I have to, uh, okay, okay, okay. I have to, like, uh, put another point here the airport, and then I can select this and make it the finish. Okay, all right, so. That's, I think that's as close as I'm going to get it. You can see it looks fairly much like it. Uh, okay, so you can see it's fairly close. Like I said, I have to put a couple of extra waypoints because you got to have the airport to take off from, and then like wherever you want to start, it's got to be another one from the airport. Same thing with this one. Okay, I was wasn't able to do put the uh, point make that the finish point because I have to like do something to an airport or to another waypoint or something. Okay, so that's pretty close. Like I said, I'll link a, a better video on how to do, to, to like, work all the controls. Well, all the controls, but enough to be able to, so you can make your own map. Copy your own map, and you can do your own waypoint. You don't have to copy something else. You can make up, set up your own flights for a flight simulator. Microsoft, Microsoft flight simulator. I just wanted to, I just wanted to do this one today. 
because I just flew it because I didn't think, like I said, I'd land it somewhere out here. And uh, this one's a thermal task. This is pretty much a thermal task. There wasn't really any ridge slowing kind of stuff. So I want to test out Microsoft's like uh, thermal settings, which are pretty, like I said, they're, they're not precise as in Condor. So you basically have this good thermaling in there. So we'll see if I can make it better, make it to the end in that one. I'm going to record that and lo upload that. All right. Okay, I'll do it for now. Oh, whoops, I forgot to sort of show you how to like download it. Okay, so uh, after you've got it all set up right, you just go up through here, this little button right here, it says download, my, it says download Microsoft Flight Simulator uh, Flight Plan. Okay, so you just click that. Okay, and it's pretty quick download. Went up to there, you see it's right there. It's a, it's a .pin file. Okay. And, uh, I have it set up to where it goes to my download folder. Okay, so there's my download folder right there. I'm going to just load it up into Microsoft. So when, I, when I fly it, record it, I'll show you how to put, where to put that. All right. Okay.